Today we are going to learn how to draw a triangle using five different ways in Inkscape. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel if you have not yet done so. The simplest way to create a regular triangle is to use the stars and polygon tool. Let us select the polygon tool. Choose the regular polygon icon up here. Set the corners to 3 the spoke ratio to its lowest, and the rounding to 0, and randomize set to 0. Then click and drag and you see we have a triangle. If you want the base to sit horizontal or vertical, select the object, hold the control key down and drag up or to the side. As we saw before, note that with the control key held down, the object can snap in angles of 15 degrees. The triangle we draw this way is an equilateral triangle with all three angles and sides being equal. If you find it necessary, you can select the object and go to fill and stroke, take away the fill and adjust the color of the stroke and its width to have a triangle bordered by lines only. For the second way to draw a triangle, we are going to make a copy of this. So duplicate this triangle object. Bring guidelines to sit at the top and the bottom of the new triangle. Select the pen tool and click on top of where you see handle to cusp not showing. Then holding the control key down, drag the mouse to the bottom where you see again handle to cusp not showing and double click to create a straight line. Now select both triangle and line, then go to path, divide. Use the selection tool to select and move one of the triangles. You can hit delete on the keyboard to delete one of the triangles. And let us select this new triangle and give it another color like deep blue. For a third way, select the rectangle tool. Hold the control key down and draw a perfect square. Hit the tab key to select the square. Then go to path, object to path. Access the nodes by double clicking or using the node tool and clicking on the object. Click on a node to select it and then hold down the control key and hit delete. You then can grab any of the nodes and adjust the triangle the way you want. Let us select it and give it a brown color. An other way would have been to hit the delete key only after converting the object to path. For that, I am going to draw another square by selecting the rectangle tool and holding the control key down to draw a perfect square. Click on the square and then go and convert the selected object to path up here. Select one of the nodes and hit delete. When we do this, we notice that we do not have a perfect triangle. We can however adjust it. You will see handles here which you can grab and pull into the nodes at the corners. Hold down the control key and pull the handles to snap at the nodes. Do this until you are happy with your triangle. Let us select it and give it a green color. The fourth way is to use the Bezier tool and while holding the control key down, you click to create a start node, move the mouse to the next angle, click to create another node, Move the mouse to the next angle, click and terminate the path by moving the mouse to the origin and double clicking. Lastly, you can go to Extensions, Render, Triangle. Here you notice you can define the side length as well as the angles up front. If you have your Inkscape open and following up, go ahead and define properties here of your choice. When all have been defined, you hit apply to draw the triangle. Voila, you have a triangle. Thanks for watching. Please do not forget to like the video and to subscribe. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.